happy morning children how are you all welcome back to the second semester okay children let us to begin one of beautiful story from your supplementary reader that is the monkey and the crocodile i think most of you may know about this story then to let us to learn once again once on the bank of a river a monkey made a home for himself in a tree which was full full of delicious fruits the monkey lived happily by eating delicious fruits as much as the monkey wanted the monkey was happy but it was lonely and wanted a companion a friend to talk and to share the fruits but there was no one around the tree not even another monkey too but one day a crocodile appeared on the river side and soon after seeing crocodile the monkey said hello there do you live in this river would you like to eat some fruit the monkey asked then the crocodile replied good morning actually i came here in search of a food for myself and for my wife as you offered me fruits it is so nice to hear this then the monkey it plucked some of the fruits from the nearest branch and threw all those fruits down where the crocodile was there and the crocodile ate those fruits and it found it delicious so oh, tasty fruits and the crocodile thanked monkey and it asked the monkey that shall i get some more fruits on my next visit then the monkey replied of course as many as you want you can have fruits along with that even you can carry fruits for your wife too and even the monkey said please come again because i am alone here i need a friend the monkey said the crocodile it visited the monkey every day and ate the fruits of which the monkey threw down actually he took some home for his wife too the monkey and the crocodile they became best friends within a short time both together they talked and they never ever tired of talking as you talk along with your friends even though classes are running in some of the times isn't it the same the monkey and crocodile too continued here and they talked about birds and animals about the villages which were near by the which were near and the difficulties of villagers which they faced in raising good crops due to lack of rain okay what happened next let us to see in second part good day children